In 2018, Polo G dropped his Finer Things music video. In the music video for that song, the world would be introduced to Polo G's brother, Trench Baby, for the first time as he made multiple cameos. Trench was only 13 at the time, being born to the same mother and father as Polo in 2005. When Trench was born, their family was living in 1300 territory, the gang his older brother claims. But when Trench was young, they moved to the Low End, an area on the other side of the Windy City. Trench, who is six years younger than Polo, was too young to ever be a member of 1300 when they lived in the gang's territory. But as he got older, he became a member of a gang in the Low End called Welsh World. This is the same gang Tay Savage claims. Tay actually shouted Trench out in an Insta Live. Shout out y'all coming. Free Trench. Free T-Baby. He got kicked out of high school in 2020 and became more involved with the gang. So while Polo became more and more famous, Trench became more and more involved in the streets. He began rapping in March 2021, making Chicago drill music. His songs contained some references to what he was doing in the streets. In his song, Just a Message, Trench says he chased an op named Baby Glock with a Draco. In the same song, he also disses a dead op named Lil Rob by saying, Lil Rob dead and they ain't spark a few. I can't lie either, he really could rap. But unfortunately, his talent isn't what would later make him famous. After Polo G's career took off, he made the wise decision to get out of Chicago. The rapper bought a $5 million mansion in L.A. in June 2021. Polo also took Trench Baby with him. But moving his brother out of Chicago didn't cool his behavior. In fact, it only made it worse. Trench constantly went back to Chicago on visits. Despite his brother's fame, Trench was really taking risks on these trips back. For example, he posted an IG story dropping his location, showing himself to be in a restaurant in the low end. Man, I'm going in a restaurant and it's charged with them shots on them. You know how we do it. to me and the right wing. You feel me? Face out, mask. Mask up. My duck. Play you, lay you, try you, die. Cold as hell, but I'll let out fire, nigga. But back in LA, Trench began causing serious problems. He started robbing numerous cameramen, streamers, and other rappers like a dude called B Bands. How you coming, go out? Bro, <laughs> man, this got them little uh, emeralds and that You was doing it with this, bro. Oh, be and rock career, nigga. Yo ass better not never. Oh, Maxine, and you better not never drop a song ever again, sure. Mike Ray. This how I break it to niggas. You gonna either get hit up or get hit up. Oh, Maxine, that little boy took the safe route. Trench would arrange to meet these guys, often using Polo's name, and once they met, he would rob them at gunpoint. DJ Academics described how bad the situation got very well on stream. Conversation in the industry for the last year is that Polo G brother has been running around here robbing every cameraman, every vide videographer. He robbed even a couple streamers. Doing all type of fuckery. I'm just being honest with you. And he's been using Polo G's name. Polo and by the way, and Polo G, if you ever, if you, you, you probably will see this, so I'll tell you this directly. It got so bad, niggas thought you were lying in people. <laughs> just to let you know. There was a thought that you were lining up people in the industry for robberies and other things. Come to find out you had nothing to do with it. That's just your brother wilding out. Again, I've heard about 10 niggas he done robbed. I'm, I'm telling you the truth. The niggas in the industry, they're scared of this guy. Ironically, his name precedes him. Trench, maybe. Keep in mind, I ain't gonna lie. A couple of these niggas told me the story. I laughed at them. I said, I wouldn't even go link up with no nigga named Trench Baby by myself. <laughs> Your name is Trench Baby? <laughs> Industry-wise, this guy has been a problem. There's been incidents, which I won't get specific, but I'm pretty sure Polo G knows. I'm pretty sure his mom knows. Actually, I know they, they know. Because at certain times, his mom and pops, I believe, had to be mediators with people who were going to go to the cops before. And things got settled. If, they, if they're listening, they know what I'm talking about. But Trench's behavior wasn't limited to robberies. 757 is a rival alliance of gangs to Trench's gang, Welch World. 
The beef between the two sets dates back all the way to the early 2000s. What's crazy is people were dying because of this feud all the way back in 2006, when Trench was only one. A particularly popular member of 757, Lil Rowe, was actually visiting LA in June 2023. Lil Rowe is probably best known for stealing four guns from the DCG brothers. At 1.30 a.m. on June 10th, 2023, Lil Rowe was walking in a car park in North Hollywood. It's unclear how, but allegedly, according to LAPD, Trench got the drop on him. Suddenly, a car sped past and Trench began shooting out of the window. Lil Rowe was hit, collapsed, and died. Now, Trench's involvement is all alleged by LAPD. His friends also did some self-snitching, like take a look at the location on this Insta post. In Trench's song CEO, which dropped two months after Lil Rowe's murder, Trench does drop some less than subtle bars when he says, Not a rapper, I'm a clapper, I'm a real grave digger. But this is an open case and Trench hasn't been convicted of anything. If you're enjoying it so far, make sure you subscribe. I'm doing my best to keep y'all in the loop about what's really going on in the streets and the industry. So subscribe so you don't miss out. Trench's activities began to catch up with him, though, as law enforcement began to apply pressure. In August 2023, Trench posted an Insta story showing the U.S. Marshals had surrounded Polo's house. They were there to arrest Trench because he had robbed a videographer only days earlier. The marshals found some serious guns in Polo's crib, and he too got arrested after he started punching one officer. This is a prime example of rappers surrounding themselves with trouble, and so end up getting dragged into it themselves. The brothers were able to post the $100,000 bond each, but things only got worse for Trench in November. LAPD charged him with Lil Rose murder. He is currently being held in LA Men's Central Jail without bond. Now, Polo hasn't spoken on the murder at all, but you already know, Trench will have the best lawyer in LA working for him. I really hope the dude is found innocent because it would be tough for another 18-year-old to rot away in a cell. It's sad to see a dude who really had a golden ticket out of the street life throw it away. If Trench does get convicted, then this is probably one of the biggest crash outs I've ever seen. I hope people in similar positions to Trench can learn from his mistakes. Rest in peace, Lil Roe, and I hope Polo and his family, including Trench, are able to get through this difficult time. Make sure you like and subscribe to let me know you enjoyed. It really encourages me to make more videos. Check out some of the other videos on my channel too.